All right, this is my new KVAR unit. Here's my electric meter. Comes straight out of that into my fuses. It drops down to this little side panel right here. This is my air conditioning breaker. I don't know if you can see this one that's off. It's a 25 amp, 230 volt breaker. These two black wires uh, go to the KVAR unit that I built and then the ground wire just hooks up to the neutral bar and this is where the wires tie into the box I'll make another video on what it looks like on the inside of that but basically it's got those are two little green lights that light up when you turn it on basically it has two banks and each bank has two uh, 30 microfarad capacitors and they're wired to where the 230s equal a 60 so you basically have 60 microfarads per side okay this is what the system off I've got my amp meter clamped on the wire directly coming in okay I'm gonna flip the switch this I'm gonna put my hand on the breaker right here okay so see if we can see this when you hear the click, you'll know. Drops down about an amp. Okay, I'm going to turn it back off. Alright, now, let me go to the other side without shocking myself. Alright, let's see if we can get that in focus. That side's pulling a little bit more. Don't really know what all is tied into that side of the house. Alright, let me see. Yep, my hand on the breaker again. Alright, I'm supposed to turn it on. Okay. My amp draw does decrease when this unit is running. I'm going to turn it back on. Or, I'll back off again. See, that amp draw rises right back up. I've heard a lot of things on YouTube about how these systems don't really work by correcting the power factor. Uh, it is reducing my overall amps coming directly out of the base of this meter. Now it may not be enough, one or two amps may not actually be enough to see a significant savings on your electric bill, but you know, it is actually doing something. Uh, I guess that's all for now.